Viewers and subscribers, big up on yourself, big up, big up, big up. And you know, so I now stop big up, you know. Well, it's a two now. Today's a two for one special. When I say two for one, I drop two videos today, yeah. And um, one is already done. This is the second one I'm going to do. So I drop two videos. Anyway, this video, the title of this video is entitled Love and Sex No Mix. I know so the woman never going to love me for that video. Yeah, you know? I know. We can see the like button them press already. And I know so the man them should have loved me too for that video yeah? because I'm going to talk some things. Well, I'm going to tell you something, a whole heap of thing, a bag of thing, a crocus bag of thing. Yeah. So what I say now? Let me say love and sex no mix. I know so every man of them woman, or them wife, or them girlfriend, or whatever you want to call your spouse. And ideally, by right, you should have loved her. It's, it's a priority that you love the person who you're with. Yeah? Or nobody there with her then. Or nobody there with him. Right? But in this case now, a lot of men kind of twist up the thing and take it one way and now do the right thing because of the love thing, which in a while, they might do the wrong thing. Basically, you've seen it happen. To a lot of people, it recently happened to my name, Maja, 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 yeah. Who don't know me at all about with that little thing we're going on. It happened to him because he must mix up love and sex in a one. You have to learn to differentiate them. You have to learn to separate them. You have to know how and when to use them. Separate and you have to know how and when to use them together. You following? Right. The reason why I said this, you know, people, listen to me now. For the man them, me I talk to you know. As a man, when you have your woman, or your wife, or your girlfriend, as I say, you must love her, treat her good, make she feel happy, make she feel good as well. But where this sex is concerned in that relationship, you have to step up different. If you don't step up, somebody I go step up for you. You yeah, follow me? If you don't step up, somebody is going to step up for you. Because a lot of men tend to have their wife and say, Oh, me don't want she cry. Me don't want she feel sad. Me don't want she this. Me don't want she that. Yes, fair enough. But when it comes to certain things, especially where the sex is concerned, you have a job to do. You have a job to perform. And you're going to have to do it to the best of your ability. Let me say yeah, I forgot to do it to the best of your ability. The, me can't bother, and me not bother, and me tired, and me this, and me that attitude. It don't work. It does not work. You have to put out the effort when it comes to learn something there. Or if you don't put out the effort, somebody is going to put out the effort for you. You understand me, some people? Listen to me now. It kind of might sound a way, but the truth are the truth. When you have your wife or your girlfriend or whatever, where sex is concerned, there are big people we can talk. You must not be afraid to apply the pressure when pressure is needed. Yeah? You must not be afraid to have your partner and more time, if you get the chance in the garage, you take it too. If you get it on the toilet back, you take it. If you get it on the wall, you take it. If you get it on the tree trunk, you take it. If you get it in a bush, you take it. Matter about your wife and your girlfriend, you know. Anywhere you can get it, take it. And I follow me so far. Anywhere you can get it, you must take it. Because if your girlfriend or your wife decide to cheat on you with somebody, Anywhere him can get it, he may go take it. And anywhere she can give him, she will go give him. She no matter if I in the toilet, you know some people have outside toilet, or run in the garage back, or walk out. If the man, if the man if can check her, she say, yeah, you can't come check me, you know. But we can't go in the house, because my husband might come any time. I mean, I don't think we'll catch a boat. We can't go in the toilet, you know. One of the garage back, one piece of board on there. We can lay down on a piece of board. 
and she will go and she will do that. And the man will take his head here. But you as the husband, you say, no, me can't do that. My wife will go in the big silly pastropedic bed and the big divan bed and the nice, cushy, comfortable place. I told my wife, I go. I did so I go put my wife and my girlfriend. I remember when time she decided to give somebody some, anywhere she can give him, she will go give him, and anywhere he can take it, he will go take it. So why? You must have your wife and make a man or your girlfriend and make a man can take her and carry her all of some little place. If we know some little alley, when man piece up, piece up, man in there, rink up and put her in there and a give her front dance, back as and all kind of cars in there and you can do it and have your wife? No. You first must do it. That means that if she have the mind to cheat with a man, him cannot carry her go at them the place there because she experienced them the place there and knows the condition in them the place there. Not nice. So if the man can carry her go to hotel or carry her go to a vineyard, he will get nothing. You understand me, I say, my people? He will not be getting nothing. Trust me, what I'm there. I'll cook too. Yes, me come back. And we must also remember, where sex is concerned, the main ingredients are the main part of it is the satisfaction part. The satisfaction part. No man feel like say, then they have their woman and in does jump on and doing thing and in belch and in feel nice and feel good and feel like in do a good job. In a thing self, if you like him do a good job, because you do man a scream and a ball and this, and then go tell him, for, yeah, me mash up that man, church, you can't manage me very, really. and if you like him do a good job, and we take a stock, the woman still did it and want the job to complete. And if you can't complete the job, nobody start the job. That is how it goes. That is how it goes. Nobody start it if you can't finish it. Satisfaction is the main important thing. And as men, you have to know how to make a woman satisfied. And you make them satisfied by doing the things that they love. Doing the things that make them happy. Doing the things that put a smile upon them face. When you don't do all of that and then feel happy, then there's no business where you want to do. You do anything where you want to do afterward but make them happy first and then you deal with what you have to deal with no the next thing again for the man they go and i say oh me know i'm a wife i'm a girlfriend if you make up her face and this and that make she make up her face make she make up her face because i saw the thing said as them say no pain no gain so but first thing first make she happy first nobody does jump on for no man and get her pain and agony and feel like say you do a good job. No. You know where they are there. You have a thing called primer. You know like when you paint your window. And you rub it down. Sandpaper pipe it down. And rub it down make it smooth. And then you put the undercoat. The primer upon it. Prime it up. Yeah. Before you put on the top coat. A paint upon it. Whether you paint one window. Or one door. Or one shelf. Or one cupboard. I so you have to do. You rub it down first. Get it smooth. Get out all the little rough edges. Them. Fill up when need filling out. Rub it down. Get it smooth. Then you put on your undercoat, and after the undercoat, then you put on the main coat, which is the top coat. As so, you have to do. If you not do that, you not do nothing. You understand? You see, the same thing happened to my brethren, Maja, 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 and Fee, woman, because a big thing now on the social media, you know? and she and allegedly she has said, well, in something small and this and very, 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 all kind of something. And I'm not small in something small either still. But woman, that's, you know, woman stay. When woman hurt it, woman, two things woman will say if you make you feel small. No matter how you're something big, they might go say small. No matter how you're good and wicked and bad in a bed like Shabarankin, they might go say, you know what? Because they know that they think that is an embarrassment and they will make you feel small. But him, on the other hand, no. He must say in lover and this. Yeah? Me not say no, in a lover. Yes, you love her. But obviously, she love Tom, she love Jack, she love Harry, and she love Dick. 
You understand me, I said, though? And it's all because when it's time for you to do the job, you play me a nice boy, you play me a sweet boy, I don't talk much about any man. You play me a nice, nice, because you want to make up her face and this. No, make she feel happy and then she make up her face afterward. When she done, make up her face, she still have to tell you thanks when, when you're done. Based on the performance, you're gonna feel happy and tell you thanks when you're done. All the murderation and batteration and what you do afterward. In no matter to her. Ladies, if I lie me, I tell, do not press the like button. Don't press it if I lie me, I tell. Yeah? In a go matter to her. But as long as you make she happy and make she feel good. Don't bring her up on top of this mountain and leave her up there. Not do that. Don't do it because that's what a lot of men do. Then bring the woman then way up on top of the mountain and then, then come down and lift the woman up on the mountain. The poor woman up on the mountain. How they lift up this big everlasting brick and put on the woman head for carry. Which in a while the woman wants what if he help her take off the heavy load off of her and put it on when she feel light. So you might come and feel like so you're the man and you might do one little thing and do your, and feel like you do your best as can to some people. And when you're gone, the postman come and the Korean might be falling and then your girlfriend might say to the postman, come out of the rain now and now wet up yourself. And maybe the postman will look fit and look good and healthy too. The next thing you know, the postman start post all kind of something all about in your place. Can you understand me? I said, oh, because you feel like you do a good job and you feel like your wife is satisfied, which she is not. And she has carried this heavy load. And she wants somebody to help her to take it down off of her. That's why I say love and sex no mix. When it comes to love, a love time. When it comes to sex, a sex time. You can do both at the same time. But you have to know how to apply it. Which one first and which one afterward. Yeah? And the next thing again. With someone. You don't need to stop it, you know. You don't need to stop it. A lot of men. You don't do some, something where it can be very effective. You don't need to stop it. A lot of men, I hear sometimes, I address them wife or them missus or them girlfriend. And I say, oh, she's like, especially if you got a birthday party and then a wife birthday or something. And then make a speech. I say, my, oh, you know, so and so. She's like a mother to me. She's like a sister to me. She's like a, this to me. All kind of relative she is to you. Do not look upon your wife then kind of way that are your girlfriend. Cause I want to start look upon your wife like she's a mother to you and a sister to you. You know what will happen. You know what you want to do nothing with her because she coming like your family now. Yeah? So don't do that. Me a big one. Don't do that. Nobody has tell her. But, oh, my wife is oh, she's like a sister to me, man. I tell her I don't know what I would do with her, without her. She's like a mother to me. I don't know what I would do without her. Do not do that. That can be very damaging and dangerous. Anytime you have your wife, sometimes you have to look upon her or your girlfriend. Look upon her like her the first time you see her. Just like a man out the road, I look upon her and see her eyes are up and thing. I say you have to do her. No matter how long you're not there, so sometimes you have to give her the look like, you know. Look upon her and, you know what I mean? Give her a look. I mean, she said, oh yeah, look upon me, sir. At first, you asked me. You say, yeah. At first, me, I say, yes. Look upon her like you look on different girl out of the road you see for the first time too. I saw it, I saw it off you go. And when she had talk and I said, you said, stay from me, so like I said, you go on talk, man. Let's get one of the general degree song, you know. You think it will go so when I hold you tonight, I go and do all of the things where you like. So you can stay there, don't believe me. Give me your chance, make a do it, make you see. Think it will go. You see what I say, my people? That is why I said love and sex, the two of them, no mix. Don't get them confused. Don't get the two of them bungled up. The two of them are two different something. But if you know how to use them, you can use the both of them together. You understand me, people? People, if me wrong, tell me say me wrong. Because I don't say me right, I can be wrong, but that is just basically my 
thinking about the whole thing and that's one of the things that put a lot of men in problem you understand a lot of nobody feel like say you say boy you no woman no, when you go for certain things woman know why you sorry for them then no one you sorry for them no sorry for them no sorry for any of them no one you sorry for them no as long as you make them happy and make them contented then they want you to show them now what you can do afterward. But not show them what you can do first. And then you know make them happy. Because you are going to end up happy. And them are going to end happy. And when them are happy, hey, you know what I'm going to Burst if they go out the road and a man look on them and say, you know, you look good, baby. You look hot and look nice. So you go feel switch. You go look on that and tell that as an invitation. Yeah. Because she get a compliment from a man. She take it as an invitation. You never know. Sometimes them invitation they go very, very far until they end up at some place. Seen? Ura! That's my come to my door. Oh. What else? Mm -hmm. Yes, when I'm sure that it's forward. Yes, my people. Sometimes. Sometimes it's better to hear your partner say, Lord, master, I'll kill you, I'll go kill me. It's better you hear she say that more than to hear she say, How are you? Do? How are you really? Do? Yeah, it's better. But as I say, try to make the woman happy first. Do all of the things that you know she loves. Do all the things that you know will make she happy first. Yeah, she ya do you do it, you do this for her, you know, and do it for yourself. All the things that you can think of to make she happy. We not say how because something with some man do me know. Yeah, and that's what I said. But the good things them where to make she happy, you do them. You understand what I said though? Yeah. And then after that, then you can make yourself happy and then everybody happy. That is the main thing about the whole idea. So my people, I don't know, I want to think about this video. I want to say about the life here, on the views. And you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like a quick story, you know. I know some of my videos, they always come with a little backup plan. plan it. You know, so you hear some big people talk, you know. Say this man, you know. He said, man, one of my videos already about this man. You should say, nobody can give him bun. So you should say, nobody can give him bun. And at the same time, thing you want to give him bun, but he don't know. So you want to give him bun. And he come from bush one evening, you know. And the first time people used to have them big kitchen, so they used to cook dinner, eat same place in the night kitchen. And he come from bush, same time, his wife sharing dinner, give him, but by this, the bun man they did already. You know, and through him come, the bun man kind of keep himself quiet, but the work never done. So the bone man never gone, but anyway, in wife shooting dinner game in the dark heat. The wife had a pound some chocolate, because I have something near Martha, and then pound the chocolate enough to make a little chocolate and great to make tea. So them kitchen first time make out a bamboo, bamboo wackle, what you call it. The bamboo, everybody know bamboo, and the post, you put one post beside each other. But sometimes when the bamboo then young, the bamboo then shrink. So when the bamboo then shrink, then left a gap in between them. Right? Around the back of the kitchen, my mother there, you know. The right man in the kitchen and heating dinner, you know. And when my heating kitchen in dinner, he might tell his wife, like he must say, Mary, you know, sir, me you say, so and so, I keep man with her husband, but me, no woman can do me that. No woman can never ever do me that. And he might yam him food, and he must say, no woman can do me that. And he might heat said we, and the woman did a pony chocolate. You do not more than lean upon the bamboo wackle, put her body upon the bamboo wackle. And I pound the chocolate. And at the same time, you know, realize my man the outer door round at the back of the kitchen. Yeah. Me not only wife I pound the chocolate. My man the round that pound her same way. And all him talk, I said, no man can do me that. And it have gone right in front of him face. And you know, see. So it happen. You understand? So, when a woman wants to do something, I tell man this. When a woman wants to do something, you can't really stop them from doing it. But what a man can do is 
do not give your woman any reason to do anything. And the only way you can prevent that from happening is be a man and be the right man and do what you supposed to do. As long as you do what you feel do and do what you feel do the right and proper way, you know, suppose you have no problem. If you have any problem, that means uh, you know, do something right. You know, something is wrong. <clears throat> There's a leakage in the pipe somewhere that needs filling. Yeah, there is a leaking, leakage in your pipe. So check your pipe good from time to time and make sure say no leakage not there. If you see like one little leakage out for going, you make sure you cock you up and fix it before it get worse. Because when certain leakage start to leak, you know, trust me, not even plumber can fix it again, you know. When certain pipes start to bust up on you and water run from all different directions, not even plumber, plumber can fix it. All you have to do is you have to take out the whole of the pipe there and change and put in a brand new piece of pipe. Because it's not repairable. Yeah? So gentlemen, you know, hear me. Love on a wife. Love on a girlfriend. Them. Love on a sweetheart. Love on a fiance. Love whatever you want to call them. Treat them good, but at the same time, do not mix and get the thing confused where love and sex is concerned are two different something. But as I say, the both of them can be used together if you know how to apply them. People, you know, I think me have not much more to say about this, you know. So let me hear your thoughts. And let me hear what I think, and maybe somebody out there might experience something. If you want to share it, feel free. If you don't want to, and you want to keep it a secret, it's all the same. Yeah? So, my people, as I said, just bless. Don't stress over a person. Remember, I know one love, enough love, and anything where we are doing, but could we go to the best of our ability? Yeah? And remember this. We have to wise up, for rise up. And last but not least, we have to educate to elevate. My people, that one are kind of long, the next one kind of shorter. But as I say, a two for one want today. So big up on yourself, my people, and have a blessed weekend. Look out for more videos coming tomorrow. Bless.